Whoa, dude, what kind of dog is that? It's a Great Pyrenees. What? Pyrenees, uh, uh, like the Pyrenees Mountains between Spain and France. I thought it was a polar bear. I was worried I was gonna have to bust out my kung fu on it. <laughs> have a good day. I remember you. I picked you up. You came to our house and did something to my wife. What did you do? I eased her soul. What? I gave her an opportunity to clear her conscience so that she could pass peacefully. I think I've seen people like you before. You prey on the old and the weak. Take their money and leave them without anything. You have a good day. She's at peace, Fred. I promise you that. You be on your way. And don't make promises you can't keep. been summoned. Who sent you? We have a strict no-question policy, Halfwit. Are you gonna grab your dog? What do you want? In general, or should I be specific? Why am I here? Isn't that the great existential question of the century? Why indeed? It was not I who summoned you here, Piccolo. Then who brought us here? Why is she here? Or will you stop with all the questions? I think it's destiny. Is that not your word? Madeline was taken, but not by you. Why do you have her? I'm discouraging reckless behavior, Michael. The kind that works its way in slowly, like an airborne disease. Until it's under your nails and you feel like chewing off your fingers to stop the pain. Madeline was given to me with free will by someone whose time was spent. Madeline's not a fair designation. She's a rethink. You don't really believe that, do you, Michael? Fred? Dear, I'm, I'm ready to go home now. You're not taking our grandchildren. I'm thinking about it. What's the point of an example if it's only halfway successful? Involving someone's family in our personal dispute is the lowest form of entitlement. Certainly, your, your pithy reputation is above scraping the bottom of our justifiable means. I kid you not. They are not for you. You put them back. We'll play you for them, Michael. Give you a soldier's chance. I'm not playing for innocence. Ever. Their presence here is not only inappropriate, it reeks of self-importance. Oh look, it appears as though you've made your first move. Stop! We're not fighting with you anymore, Michael. You don't win. It's probably the biggest thing hindering your success. The Overseer. Who's she? 
she's undecided on his side. I can speak for myself, Michael. She's temporary. We were just having a conversation regarding her legitimacy. Is an intervention necessary? Not yet. So, here we are. Two contentions for you. And two for you, Michael. Now, I still don't understand why all of your assignments have to be such a problem. Our rules are very straightforward. But perhaps if you spent more time on primal gradients and less on doggy daycare. But that's just my eons of experience talking. These are borderline individuals. In my opinion, they're not even worth the effort that we spend on them. It's just the persuasiveness of your alma mater that gives them any credence at all. So, we're granting you two more and if you fail, we're going to replace you. Okay, cowboy? And don't let me catch you forging a directive again. You let the game play out the way it should. Insect. Get rid of her. And put her children back. I'll rearrange her internal organs. Well, another chance for you. Isn't that all warm and fuzzy? We were so much alike in the beginning. Don't you remember? I'm sad that this is us now. Always at each other's throats trying to prove a point. We're processing human beings. Never forget that. I, you were once one of them. Back when you held a conscience and a, and a belief in the possible. Let's make our decisions based on integrity and plausibility. Not this, uh, this fanatical myopic need to win that infests every inch of your beings. Give me Madeline. You're not even gonna miss her. I don't benefit if you win. You benefit by knowing that we all play by the same rules. Yes, but who made those rules, Michael? Someone ridiculously tired of individuals like you. Are you calling us cheaters, Michael? Yes. And worse, even. Opportunists! I'm not a big fan of you. Even on your good days. All right, Michael. You can have Madeline. But only because I'm a believer in the power of the One. Prove to me she's worth the effort. Quicker next time, please. Is he becoming a problem? Not yet. But you really do need to work with me if we're to make any progress. I'm doing my part, but the Overseer is starting to ask questions about you. I'm deflecting, but... Don't worry not, my dear. Send me back. I'll create a dimensional shift. Get their minds off of us. I'm trusting you.
and forgot these. Take my rest with my loved ones near. I've heard some lies, spoke more truths. Age too quickly in my youth. Swallow pride, bit my tongue, till all the breath would leave my lungs. It's far too little. I still wait. Shall mercy follow? Is it too late? Quiet my fear, silently pray. Bide the time till my soul leaves this day. I've no more songs to write or sing. No flight left in these tired wings. Just close my eyes, leave me here. I'll take my rest with my loved ones near. Let me rest, keep my loved ones near.